we're set to go here. Canucks start with Pedersen, Hoaglander, and Besser up front. Hughes and Horonic on defense. And as mentioned a moment ago, we're talking like they go with seven defensemen this game. Mark Friedman is in the lineup. Niels Oman is in the lineup. Not in the lineup are Noah Jules. Here's uh, Pedersen with an early chance. And now Hoaglander put it wide. Jules is not in the lineup, nor is Pugh Suter. Arizona really thrilled with the progression of his play this year. 17 goals. I mentioned Kadar has 21. The two teenagers. There's a shot by Zadora, knocked down and held by Ingram for Kraus. Gunther takes the puck to the corner. Behind the net for Cooley. Now a shot by Kraus and Shelovs. His first test of the game. Stops in the corner and sends one back. Gunther across and a long shot up high. Reaching up with Shelovs as that one sailed over top of the goal. Back for Hughes, but it hops over his stick, and this power play is just struggling to get set up. Hronik in on a lead pass from Hughes. Wish shot, glove saved by Ingram. And then Hronik took Jersey down as Ingram dropped the puck. Susie risked the puck in as Pugh stand steps up. Canucks had one shot, that was Hronik, and they're 0 for 1 on the power play in the scoreless first period. Here's McKayev, wraparound try. Ingram able to keep that out. Keller backhands the puck ahead. Ducks to get away from Brown in the corner. That was a neat move. Joshua, Peronic, and now Hughes with room. Loads up, lets it go. Stick saved by Ingram. Friedman sends the puck the other way. Brought back in by Michelli. Dishes off to Dome. Down the left wing, and a shot by Valimaki is stopped by Shelovs. Just Connor Garland looking for a passing option. Now makes a move down the boards. Keller trying to stay with him. Garland. Feeds back. Joshua with a shot. Stopped by Ingram. Rebound was there. Keller gets a return pass on the near side. Back to Dursey. One-timer blocked by Bluger. Trying to poke at the puck. Couldn't reach it. Keller has it. Down to Gunther. Sharp angle shot. Stopped by Sheelovs. Myers fights for the puck. Gunther takes it away. Gives it away to Susie who rims it around. Jersey can't keep it into the right point. Now Bluger pokes it ahead. Here he comes shorthanded. Oman's in front. Bluger centers. Deflected on goal. And then Oman on the rebound. Couldn't beat Connor Ingram from in tight. 45 seconds. Canucks had a good chance shorthanded. Really great work from Bluger who had blocked the shot just earlier. He gets it across the flex and Oman gets a rebound. Two stays. Two stops for Ingram. Clayton Keller, the forward team. And you get a secondary chance. If you hit the net, not only, of course, can you score, but you'd start to generate a little more, more momentum of staying in the zone and staying on the four check. Sent around behind the net. Susie there. Brings it to the corner. Can't move it out. Chance in front. Shot wide. What a chance by Clayton Keller to extend his point streak to nine, but he missed the net. Pointman intercepting is Hughes. Gets it to Brock Besser. And now Hughes takes his pass and steps into the left wing, gets around O'Brien, sharp angle shot, and somehow Ingram held it out. Jersey taken down, look to the official. Play continues, and now Carconi's pass is broken up, and the puck is out to center, stolen by McKayev. Cutting it off the left wing, McKayev to the net, he deeks, and a left toe saved by Ingram. Might have caught a piece of the outside of the post as well. McKayev close to opening the scoring, now Myers a long shot, missed the net. Cole keeps the puck in on the far side. Checked by Liam O'Brien. Stolen back by Cole. Here's McKayev again. Into the corner for JT Miller. Behind the net to Connor Garland. Garland makes one back. Joshua lets it go to Ian Cole. Back in deep for Garland. Makes a nice move to the corner. Cuts and rubber a shot off the glove and over top of the net as Ingram stopped that one. Doesn't happen very often. Garland. Check. Patterson after the puck. Couldn't come up with it. Butte stand gets it. That hit the referee came right in front. Ingram able to clear it to the side. Hoaglander keeps the puck alive. Oh, good job. Besser lifted the stick, and then he just missed. Arizona. Friedman takes his pass and risks the puck into the Arizona end. Miller's onto it. Overskated it. Joshua there in support. Gets it around to GT Miller. Now Garland with a shot and a stick saved by Ingram. As he plays his 338th consecutive game, dating back to his Toronto days. November 2019, the last time he missed. Here's McKayev, and Bluger hit the side of the net. What a chance to bump his slump. You've gone so long without a, a tally, you've got this chance. Put Coles in and McKayev combine on this play, and Bluger just heals. Howdy's unable to manufacture a chance there. Daniel Sedin and Ryan Kessler each hit the 40 plateau in that 2010-11 season. Here's a lead pass, Miller in off the glove of Ingram. 
Shot mid stride from well out, trying to fool the goaltender, I think. He didn't even go out his left hand on it. Here's Miller again. Across. Patterson takes it off the boards. Back to Hughes. Miller in front. Pass serve. Left pad saved by Ingram. That was a good one. Now Patterson back to Hughes. Had to settle that puck. Patterson takes his pass on the left side across from Miller. Did well to handle that one. That was a bit of a rocket. Now Hughes long shot scores. Garland was in front screening. I think it's Hughes goal though is third in two games and Queen Hughes makes it one to nothing. Ingram's actually looking over top of him. He looks over his shoulder and as he's trying to find the puck, the screen is perfect. And the Hughes shot goes through Connor Ingram. The Canucks get a well-deserved first goal. It goes. And now Garland steps up through center. Pedersen, oh, he gets stood up and knocked to the ice by McBain. Here's Kraus the other way. Lawson Kraus centers the puck. Moser stopped, and now there's going to be a fight as Miller challenges McBain after the hit on Elias Pedersen. And they've squared off right at center. McBain with some right hands with Miller hunched over. But JT Miller stepped right in after McBain knocked Pedersen to the ice with an open ice hit at the Arizona blue line. Pedersen doesn't expect it, and McBain delivers a, a solid hit. Miller turns around and waits for him, and they drop the gloves in the middle of the ice, and this is important for... Got to be a relief to get in here. Does all the hard work, all the extra skating. Now he gets a chance for the payoff. And hopes there'll be more chances like that as Pedersen hit the outside of the post with that sharp angle bid. Hughes keeps the puck in, but it's ricocheted off Schmaltz and out. Keller gets it and chips the puck deep into the bank of his own. Schmaltz from behind the goal. Leaves there for Clayton Keller. To the blue line. Kessler in. Keller. Across to Schmaltz. Now down for Keller. Throws one across, and what a stop by Stilovs on a one-timer by Kesselring. Just six shots at the time. Arthur Stilovs makes a tremendous read. It's been a really good 40 minutes for the Canucks and for Ilya Mikheyev. Underway in the third. The good news is that means they've certainly dominated play in this game, but just the one goal to sh show for it on a second period power play from Quinn Hughes. Now here's a steal and a chance for an odd man rush. Cooley on the right wing, cutting towards the goal. Stop, rebound, how did they miss that? Oh my goodness, the puck stayed out. Now Everybody else is caught out of position. There's the quickest of the Arizona forwards, Logan Cooley, he gets outside of. Sean Dersey, wrist shot blocked by Joshua, that's stung. But he stays on his feet and continues to defend. Keller, down to Kerfoot. Alex Kerfoot, Clayton Keller, down to Kerfoot. Centers, Gunther scores! It started sloppy and a little sluggish. The Canucks go shorthanded twice. And this is a nifty little play. Keller keeps his point streak alive as he and Kerfoot combine to set up Dylan Gunther. Gunther's got 13 goals in 38 games. As he beats Shelov, no chance there, and it's 1-1. Through center, it's Garland. Joshua, back for Garland. In front for Joshua, to the net! Stopped by Ingram, as those two work a little give and go to set up the chance. And the puck to each other, Garland and Joshua, a little pitch and catch, and then Garland reverses that puck. Works his way across, backhander stopped by Ingram. Verona trying to keep the puck alive. Canucks changing while controlling in the... Arizona and the ice. Hughes with a shot. Missed on the short side. Garland scores! The ex-Coyote took that one off the end boards and roofed it. And with a minute 51 to go, Vancouver leads 2-1. This is magical watching Quinn Hughes. Good luck trying to stay in front of him. This is the tail end of it as Garland comes off the bench. The shot hits the boards. And Garland's in the right spot. Sharp angle. Oh, and like a shortstop. Ingram tries to get over. He can't get it. Garland sticks it right in the roof. The Canucks get a late goal from Connor Garland. 
He has winners in back-to-back -back games here in Arizona. He scored the winner in overtime in the season finale last year, and he gets the one at 18.09 here of the third.